The person who shares a deep connection with you is currently undergoing a profound transformation. This change isn't random, rather. It's a direct response to the shifts they've witnessed in you as you've evolved. Observing your growth has compelled them to change and grow themselves. However, this process isn't without its challenges. They're facing significant upheaval in their life, a turbulent period of uncertainty and change that tests their resilience and strength. This upheaval may stem from financial issues, such as a sudden change in economic stability, or it could be karmic, a result of past actions influencing their present circumstances. Karma, the universal law of cause and effect, is making its presence felt, urging them to acknowledge and address the consequences of their choices. As they confront their karma, their fey aid is slipping away, revealing their true self. They're forced to confront their own reality, which can be painful. The loss of connection with you exacerbates this pain, even if it's temporary. Your absence in their life is causing them considerable distress. They are in immense agony, a pain intensified by the fear of potentially losing you forever. In their solitude, they find themselves desperately longing for your return, seeking solace and guidance from higher realms, from angels and the divine. They keenly sense that you're no longer waiting for them, adding another layer of anguish to their already difficult situation. Their suffering isn't solely emotional but also spiritual. They feel as though they're being punished by a higher power for the wrongs they committed against you in the past. These actions, driven by anger and frustration, now haunt them, engulfing them in deep guilt and remorse. This sense of divine retribution amplifies their suffering, leaving them to endure in silence and heightening their feelings of isolation and hopelessness. Their emotional turmoil is pushing them towards a mental breakdown. The tables have turned and they now experience the same pain and heartache they once inflicted upon you. Behind closed doors, shielded from the world's gaze, they weep, yearning for you grappling with profound regret and guilt. The weight of their mistakes and the understanding of the pain they caused you are overwhelming, plunging them into a profound sense of remorse. Your absence in their life isn't merely a physical void. It's pushing them to the edge of their sanity. They feel a magnetic pull towards you an energetic attraction reminiscent of the bond you shared during the early stages of your journey together. This longing for your presence serves as a constant reminder of what they've lost, intensifying their emotional turmoil. Undoubtedly, this is a challenging period for them, a time marked by intense struggle and change. However, it's also a time of growth, transformation, and ultimately, healing. They're learning from their mistakes, drawing strength from their experiences, and hopefully evolving into a better version of themselves. While this journey is painful, it's essential, as growth often stems from adversity. At this moment, I find myself in profound pain and disorientation. Despite enduring numerous trials and tribulations, I am plagued by a sense of inadequacy. It feels like no matter what I do or how hard I try, it's never sufficient. I feel lost, having found the one person who I believe to be my true love, yet unable to be with her. This is a source of immense distress for me, as all I desire is to embrace my divine feminine, to stand by her side, to shine with her, and to reassure her that she is never alone. The path I currently tread is veiled in darkness, a challenging journey fraught with uncertainty and fear. Yet, amidst the shadows, I hold on to hope. I believe in the existence of a light at the end of this tunnel, a beacon of hope promising a brighter tomorrow. In the midst of this turmoil, I find myself ensnared in a labyrinth of my own thoughts and doubts. I grapple with profound issues of self-worth 
questioning my value and my role in the world. Prior to our meeting, I've weathered what is termed as the dark nights of the soul periods of intense suffering and spiritual crisis. However, none of those experiences compare to the depth of the one I presently endure. This particular dark night has shattered my ego and upended all my former beliefs. It compels me to confront my deepest fears and insecurities head on. Your presence in my life has stirred me in ways I never foresaw. From the moment we met, I recognized you as my one true love. It felt as though our souls had a connection spanning lifetimes, instantly recognizing each other. The separation we now endure feels like a curse unnatural and agonizing to the point of almost being unbearable. I ache for you, yearning to hold you close, to bask in your warmth, and to reaffirm my love for you. I am certain of your affection for me, just as my love for you remains unwavering. I would do anything to be reunited with you, to once again share my life with you. Through this journey, I'm beginning to grasp the essence of unconditional love. I am learning to love without expecting anything in return, without placing conditions or reservations. I am awakening to the profound significance you hold in my life, realizing how integral you are to my very existence. I implore your patience as I navigate through this challenging phase of my life. This message is especially directed to those who find themselves in the early stages of a similar journey. It serves as a testament to the power of love, the resilience of the human spirit, and the enduring hope that even in the darkest of moments, there is a glimmer of light at the end of the tunnel. It is a reminder that despite feeling lost or alone, we are never truly isolated. We are all interconnected, bound by the threads of love and compassion. And it is through this interconnectedness that we ultimately find our way back to each other, back to love, and back to ourselves, even amidst the solitude of our existence. I find myself intentionally disconnecting from those who oppose me and the bond we share. It's a deliberate act of self-preservation, a necessary step toward self-discovery. Honestly, it's liberating. It feels like shedding a heavy burden, bringing a profound sense of tranquility. I am at peace, my thoughts consumed by you, my heart resonating with the rhythm of our connection. Understanding you and the depth of our bond was initially challenging, akin to unraveling a complex puzzle or navigating through a labyrinth of emotions and shared experiences with no clear beginning or end. But now, clarity emerges. The fog of confusion dissipates, revealing a path guiding me back to you. I discern a purpose now, a clear objective that demands my attention, energy, and commitment. Before meeting you, I felt adrift, caught in life's relentless currents, merely letting life happen to me instead of taking control. I used to spend my time on trivial matters, getting lost in the mundane and inconsequential. Then you entered my life and everything shifted. You saw potential in me, a spark that I hadn't noticed. Your belief in me initially felt overwhelming, like a weight that left me mentally and emotionally drained. It triggered a whirlwind of emotions within me, a storm I wasn't prepared for. But now, I'm grateful for that storm. It was a catalyst that guided me back to a path of abundance, one I had strayed from. There was a period when I lost myself, engulfed in the chaos of life and the whirlwind of emotions sparked by your belief in me. But now, it feels rejuvenating to rediscover myself, to reconnect with the person I once was and the person I meant to be. Our telepathic communication, the silent conversations of our hearts, has been instrumental in this journey of self-discovery. It's been a source of healing a balm for the wounds inflicted by life. In this journey, you're more than just a companion. 
You're my guide, my mentor, my confidant. You're the missing piece that completes me, the other half of my being. Our bond transcends mere connection. It's a fusion of souls, a merging of hearts, a meeting of minds. As I continue on this journey with you by my side, I eagerly anticipate discovering more about myself, about us, and about the incredible journey that lies ahead.